what is up my divine feminists if you are new here welcome please like comment and subscribe become a triple gog because you know we got the god-given gifts on this here channel period and to my returning subscribers welcome back my triple gog you know how we rocking okay period if you um purchase a personal reading those will be getting sent out uh most likely today but by the end of the week for sure but um yes and i am still having a sale so that information will be down below if you would like to purchase one thank you to anybody who has purchased thank you for clicking on this video thank you for trusting me with your energy all right so the downloads that i was getting for divine feminist was it's okay to be a lover girl just be stingy with your love all right and then um I was hearing extrovert. So somebody could be an extrovert. You could be an extrovert, divine feminine, or somebody that you're attracting is an extrovert. So get ready to be out and about, okay, is the energy that I'm getting, okay? So let's see. Switch you guys, angels, ancestors. Send me love, God, and clarity. Please come through. God in my higher self, please come through. Give me clear on these messages. Archangel Michael, please come through and protect me. While well, I channel the message for my divine feminines, my lovely, beautiful divine feminines. What's, what is divine feminine's energy at this time, Holy Spirit? Self-love and power. Yes, now I'm hearing uh, that pussy up out. She went in a shower. We fucking for hours. I'm crying. Look, y'all know y'all. Look, on this channel, divine feminines is my pussy fairies. All right, that's why we got the fairy oracle that we waiting, okay? with fluidity okay yes i feel like this fluent self-love oh i love this for you divine feminine this fluent self-love here is is your way of calling your power back to you all right doing this every day i'm here ritualistically so you could be doing rituals as well self-love rituals um full moon new moon rituals not even just that just you know ritualistic things so getting your hair done consistently nails done consistently doing your shadow work consistently showering consistently smelling good looking good feeling good inside and out is what i'm getting here yes i love that for you divine feminine okay also yeah being that lover girl to yourself getting that love getting that energy to yourself period divine feminine i'm loving this energy for you Wow, look, and I just picked this up in the Empress with Temperance. Oh my God, angels. You are literal earth angels here. I love that for you guys, Divine Feminine. So yeah, some of y'all may want to get a personal reading or purchase a personal reading. Definitely go ahead. I'm having a sale for the whole month of July. So get it while supplies last, okay? <laughs> I'm crying. Yeah, I also get like, you're limited edition, Divine Feminine. That's how people feel about you. It's like, get it while supplies last here. It's not a lot of options out here. It's not a lot of good women out here. It's not a lot of Divine Feminines out here or real Divine Feminines. Divine Feminines that have actually done the work and you know can claim the title of being a divine feminine can claim the title you know of being you know in their power divine a, a divine being yes this is your justice here i love that for you so it's like yeah you putting in the work you're doing things that are good for you you're doing things that you know are good for you all right yeah not just that make you feel good or temporary satisfactions here yeah i'm speaking real shit here some of you guys could be tarot readers or shamans or you know so you're really tapping into your intuitive gifts is what i'm hearing intuitive gifts spiritual gifts or some of y'all could be musicians here some of y'all could be speakers all right actors actresses or you have big dreams and big goals here divine feminine and spirit is definitely want to make sure that these you know come in for you page of pentacles yes you're still learning i'm also getting like you know you divine feminine you know fool you you you're no fool oh yes yes thank you holy spirit you're no fool and you know you are aware that nobody knows everything and everybody is constantly learning so it's giving this sense of you know being modest and also standing in your power it's like wow this big mighty divine feminine this big mighty energy is yet you know she doesn't the biggest in the room but yet the one taking the most notes when i'm getting it's like the smartest 
the smartest one in the class, but yet taking the most notes before for four on the phone. Yes, thank you, Holy Spirit. The the smartest one in the class, but also the one that takes the most notes. It's like, yeah, you're the smartest one in the class because you take the most notes. You know what I'm saying? It's not like, oh, I'm I'm the smartest, so now I don't have to continue to put in that work. No, you you understand that it is a continuous thing, divine feminine, or this is something that you're working on here. Consistency is key. Clarify this temperance. We got the King of Swords. So it's not, yeah, somebody want to talk. Queen of Swords, somebody want to talk. This could be somebody who you're, you're separated from. Somebody who you're cold towards. For some of you guys, this is somebody who, you know, never got out of the friend zone or something. Or a, a connection never really came to play or something. You could have been waiting on somebody. Somebody also want to tell you some truth here. Somebody wants to tell you that they feel like you're gorgeous. Now I'm hearing, oh my God, now I'm hearing Fantasia. Truth is, I never should have let you go. It's killing me, but now I know when it's all said and done. Because I'm still in love with you. Truth is, yeah, somebody's like, somebody might say, you know what? The truth is, I'm still in love with you. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I feel like you're keeping some snake at arm's length here. This could be like a family member. This could be somebody who you you deem as a snake. Okay, an ex lover or something that did you that did you dirty here. Yeah, somebody you could like toe rings. Press our empress. Yeah, and and wanted to come out here. I feel like yeah, you're gaining momentum. Your your manifestations are coming through divine feminine. You also could have manifested to break free from somebody that's coming or it has come already and now something is speeding up for you. Your manifestations are speeding up because you broke free from somebody or this could even be you and your masculine energy. Okay, you have to, you know, get real with yourself and tell yourself the truth about something here. All right, yeah, you could have been patiently waiting to be able to actually finally sit in your feminine energy here and I feel like this is coming through. All right, yeah, you could even be blocking yourself. You're now allowing yourself, yeah to sit in this feminine energy all right clarify this uh experience the power of a real tarot reading from a true shaman i just saw the seven of swords and then the justice card came out so yeah somebody was sneaking somebody could have also um they was dating other people somebody was dating other people okay or somebody you you may feel like that you gotta sneak and date other people to like um not hurt somebody's feelings or something or somebody don't want you to be dating and somebody don't want you to go get to go off and marry somebody else somebody don't want you communicating with other people somebody want this person whoever this is could have been trying to keep you caged here they didn't want your light to be shown and like i said for some of you this could have even been you holding yourself back here but yeah, you're getting your just due, all right? Some type of karma has been played out. The, the scales have been balanced. Or the scales will be balanced when you tap into this Empress energy. Fully step into your Empress energy and walk away from this devil energy. Walk away from this karmic, this toxic energy, toxic behavior. Whatever this is that was holding you back. Whatever this is that was causing blockages. All right, you, you know, call your power back to you. All right, yeah. Clarify this page of points here. You could be researching or... um. Some of y'all could be starting a new job or starting a new business, you know, starting from the bottom now we here type of energy is what I'm getting. Clarify this page of coins. Or y'all could be in school for something as well. It's the cups here. We got this self-love. Yeah, some of y'all, yeah, you're you're some of y'all are teaching yourself self-love. You're reparenting yourself. All right, is the energy that I'm getting here. It's like all the things that you thought that you couldn't do, you're now teaching yourself how to. Yes. And the world is on your side here. I'm also getting that you got you you've completed some type of cycle. I'm also hearing the world is yours. I really don't want to get none of these, but they want me to. Can I get like two? Yeah, we got praying mantis here. So you could be seeing praying mantis. You could also be praying a lot here. We have good luck, good fortune, wealth, success, large family, the cycle of life. Yeah. So you're going through um gang them. Okay, so you and you're you're calling in 
real friends here, real soul family. Also, for some of you guys, your friends could have been the blockage here as well. It's time to get people on your level or you're calling in people on your level. But this is what you have already here. Let's get some fairy messages from my divine feminists, my pussy fairies. Okay, tree wisdom. Go hug a tree, my love. All right, it says this tree dread will help you navigate through your current situation. Her flute can reveal insights and answers through, wow, the sound that makes something about a flute is very significant. You could play a flute or you may need to listen to some uh, Native American flute music and meditate, all right, because it's two flutes here. So some of y'all could be from, you, you could have a Native American ancestry, but yes, definitely uh, listen to some Native American flute music. I know my first time listening to that, my third eye open wide the up, okay, I had the sage burning, the Native American flute music playing in the background, and my yoga mat sat on there in lotus position and meditated. All right, so maybe some of y'all need to do that. Okay, look in a book here. Yeah, it's time for you to get more knowledge. Or like I said, some of y'all could be going back to school or going to school. All right, whatever your question right now, you'll find the answer in a book. The words you find will bring the insights you see. Can I have one more fairy? Okay. Look, they gave me two, period. Flourish. You're about to start flourishing if you haven't already. I love this for you, Divine Feminine. Yes, you're a journey, taking a journey on self-love. All right, now I'm here, and I wish that I could take a journey through your mind. Yeah, so somebody, I want to know, I want to know what turns you on. So, yes, back to that download in the beginning. It's like, you could be... It's okay to be a lover girl, just be stingy with your love. Make sure that you're a lover girl for the people who are ready and willing and wanting to explore you so that you can flourish, so that you can feel the love. It's not for any selfish gains or monetary gain or whatever it is. So make sure that you are giving your love to somebody who wants to explore you as a person and wants to love you for who you are and not change you but help you grow as well as the energy that i'm getting okay it's time to prepare for a journey it may be impromptu or planned either way make sure you're ready when the time comes pack your passport now so some of y'all may need to get your passport because y'all may be traveling 12 12 on the phone all right so i may be going on a vacation yeah my y'all just heard how my voice just tried to come out fairy spotting you're a fairy look in the mirror divine feminines also people feel like you are a fucking fairy this is how they see you it's like yeah somebody's like i gotta yeah i i, I gotta i i have to you know get on that i can't let this one slip me slip by okay it says it's time to go fairy spotting it said that seeing is believing but in fact the opposite is true believing is seeing all right so divine feminine how do you see yourself when you look in the mirror all right or do you believe that you're a fairy do you believe that you can manifest and make things happen for you do you believe that you can call your power power back do you believe that you know you can tap into these gifts do you believe that you can do it all right do you believe because if you don't, I don't, I don't even think that this reading for you did. Because if you don't believe in magic, baby, what you want is channel for? <laughs> okay, but let's, let's get some final message from our divine feminine and Holy Spirit. Can I have four? We have, I am bold. Yes, you are bold. Okay, period. I am exactly where I need to be. I am wealthy. Remember, wealthy wealth is a mindset as well. I release all fear. Yes, stay prayed up, my loves. All right, I am aligned. None of my chakras are blocked. I love that for you. Stay consistent in your routine. Stay consistent in your rituals. Stay consistent in cleansing your energy. Stay consistent in giving yourself that self-love and even that extra self-love in those times where, you know, you feel a little more down or you feel you're going through some things or, you know, you're healing because y'all know when you heal and them random ass trauma that random ass trauma pop back up and you like oh my god this is why this oh my god this is you know those realizations or whatever give yourself that extra tlc all right i love y'all this was your reading please like comment and subscribe and become a triple gog because you know you got the god giving gifts on this here channel bye